this software is available 19c we are learning only or c means cloud technology cloud computing is there in a old and this grid computing is there now cloud what is cloud and all these things <clears throat> we are understandable now this is what i kill 19c 19c means c means cloud technology <clears throat> observe it here this is the latest version we are learning in our class but what is this oracle slowly observe it here screen observe it oracle is a product from oracle corporation okay but here this is a database product observe it here oracle is a database product there is so many fellows having idea oracle is a database product okay fine and now check it out <clears throat> not only oracle so many database products are available in our okay so no country okay sorry in a software side so many okay database products are available suppose oracle is a database product from oracle corporation observe it here different different companies again maybe so many fellows having idea sql server is a database product from microsoft db2 is a database product from ibm company mysql is a database product that is a open source but nowadays oracle corporation only purchasing again sybase is a database product from ingress corporation again terra data terra data maybe so many people have an idea data warehousing application programmers terra data is a database product from ncr corporation sql light is a database product like there so many so many so many database products are there from different different companies only okay na? that's why always oracle is a one of the popular database product okay fine database don't write it anything just observe it here database but what is the purpose of these database products means everyone knows whenever we are installing a what these database products in our system otherwise company side what is the main purpose means for storing data for storing don't write it anything observe it here for storing data permanently permanent for storing data permanently 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 in secondary storage devices secondary storage devices means maybe hard disk or not yes here one of these okay secondary storage devices secondary storage devices okay fine permanent suppose today we are storing a what data means after okay, five years ten years after 10 years after 20 years after 100 year after also your data is available you are using now that's why always these are oracle is a product from oracle corporation some version number is there this is a database product one of the popular database one of the popular vocational okay, so database is a oracle is a product from oracle corporation but what is the purpose of that one means for storing data permanently in secondary storage devices now slowly observe it here actually so many database applications are there in a worldwide 90 percent of these software applications are depends on database without database impossible to store the water data now check it out suppose for example you are a first time newcomer <clears throat> so now if you are non-technical person means easily understandable means every organization maintain a database okay fine for example observe it here for example okay so now yes easily understandable so many applications are there one of the application I'm taking. you take bank banks maintain databases banks maintain maintain databases observe it here what is the purpose they are maintaining about database means storing or something means observe it here suppose yes here customers are okay account holders are deposit some amount you are also depositing some amount only your details your name address phone number your balance your account number these details are storing is important permanently 
Now that's why yes, account holder or customers are deposit some amount only. Those details they want to store permanently. Suppose here you are also, I am also. Otherwise, some customers are withdrawing some amount. Okay, fine. Those details also they want. Again, some fellows are transferring what money from one account to another account, either online or offline or anywhere also. And now those all the transaction information I want to store permanently. Then only we are operating all the things. That's why uh, now here, yes, your banks maintain databases. Banks means everyone understandable. That's why. Suppose your telecom companies, yes, so many examples are there, just roughly uh, now here, easily understandable purpose. I'm telling only telecom companies maintain databases. Suppose here, yes, you are making a call to your friend or anything, those call details are where it will be storing in a databases. Suppose here, and now here online, suppose so many fellows are nowadays purchasing items in a where online portals through Flipkart, Amazon, those type of, so now so many okay, so now online shopping portals are there. Through that one, so now they're purchasing items. Those shopping portal also maintain a databases because you are purchasing a what one okay, so now item means that order number, how it will be generated. Database, some application is there, auto increment concept only through that one. Nowadays, in a banking system, OTP validation is there. In a phone number, we are typing only, then automatically generate a word that OTP only, then you are sending that OTP. How? Database application. That's why so many different reservations, all the things. Okay, so now so many applications in a worldwide, in a real time application, maintain databases. Okay, fine maintain databases and now check it out concentrate here concentrate very important now okay fine suppose i'm a first time newcomer how i'm thinking oh maybe database is nothing is there suppose i'm installing a what oracle software that is a one of the database software only whenever i'm installing a what oracle software into my system automatically some place is created in a hard disk only Oh, maybe this place is called a database only. Okay, so many fellows are thinking like that. Okay, database. Okay, fine. Here only in this place only we are storing a data. Suppose here, here we are storing a what? In a random collection of data, we are thinking only. That is absolutely wrong one. Actually, Oracle, SQL Server, DB2, Sybase, Informix, Ingress, Teradata, these type of databases are not storing a what a random collection of data. These databases does not store a random collection of data. These databases only store structured collection of data. That is important. Suppose here nowadays, NMA, okay, random collection of data, any data storing means some non-relational databases are there. That is MongoDB. That is different. These databases, Oracle, SQL Server, DB2, these databases are relational databases. Relational databases. Relational databases. One of the popular relational databases, Oracle and SQL Server and MySQL, these databases. What is relational databases we are learning in a future? Don't worry. And now here, these are these databases stores a what a structured collection of data. Suppose here I'm installing a what Oracle software in my system. You are also installing in a future in installation. I will tell you. Now once we are installing a what this Oracle software, some database is play some places created in a hard disk. Now in this place, this is a relational database product. That's why we are storing a what a structured collection of data. Why? Because relational data model is introduced by 1970 only EF Cord. He is basically mathematician. That's why he decided to store the data in the format of matrix. Matrix are nothing but rows and columns or not. Maybe you have an idea. I think uh, mathematics only rows and columns. Same like uh, yes, your data is stored in the where logical structure side. What is logical? What is physical later? And now here logical structure side here table format only a structured manner only data is storing once a structured collection of data is there yes all relational databases stores a what a structured collection of data that is important not a non-structured non-structured means another databases are there oracle is one of the popular relational database structured collection of data structured collection of data only storing by the where these type of relational databases once a structured collection of data is there, we are operating a what this data by using a what some languages are required. What is that language means? Maybe anybody having an idea? 
SQL is a long way, structured query long ways. SQL is a long way is there. Through this long ways only, we are operating about a data in a way, this structured data in a relational databases. But MongoDB, those type of databases are different. That is SQL language is not there. There is no SQL. That is JavaScript, those type of languages, you have an idea, no? So now here, yes, those knowledges are required. But this is SQL is a one separate language is there. Through that one, we are, okay, so now if you're operating a data in this struct, okay, in these type of databases. Now check it out, concentrate here. For example, don't worry. Suppose this is a Oracle database, okay, fine. Really, in my system, okay, so many classes we are learning, okay, so now we are teaching only, that's why, yes, so many tables are there. Check it out, observe it here. In my Oracle database, observe it here, this is a what, some table is there, okay, something is there, for example. Here, 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 in this database, a structured collection of data is there or not? Yes, organized fashion only, they are storing a data. Observe it here, you are also storing a what in a feature like this. Organized fashion means, oh, maybe table, here these are columns, here these are rows only, here columns are there, something, an organized manner only, they are storing the data. Slowly observe it here, oh, maybe this matrix format here, employee number, in this column, only numbers are available. Slowly observe it here. Yes, in this column, only characters are available. Yes, in this column, only dates are available. That's why I observed here a structured manner only the data is storing. Suppose here, in a, in a, in a, okay, anything we are observing also in your database, relational database side, a structured data is there. Okay, fine. A structured collection of data is there. Suppose, for example, once this data is there in a permanently, now how we are operating this data by using SQL long ways they are telling. Suppose, for example, this is a what data is there. For example, what is data? What is information? Later we are learning. Observe here. New York is a city is there, for example. In my project, I want to change. Today, I want to change this New York location into where Hyderabad is a location in my project side. For example, maybe uh, now here. Suppose I want to change a what this New York location into where Hyderabad is location I want to change in this relational databases. How can I mean is just in a very SQL prompt only SQL long ways we are using. Oh, SQL language means very easiest language. How means? I will tell you. And now SQL language is there in a feature. You are typing us some commands. Observe it here. Update table. Okay, something is there. And now here, yes, here some commands we are typing like this. So only single or two lines of commands, only simple. That's why anybody also learning a what? Yes, so SQL language very easy. And now here, yes, without any knowledge of the where software also easily there. Okay, handling. And now check it out. One line of coding I'm writing. If this coding you are familiar in a future, you are learning a courses like or I kill SQL server, these type of courses. That is called SQL command. These are called SQL long ways. One line of coding is there, no? Yes, here. These are non-procedural long ways. Variables are not there. Okay, so now your loops are not there. Conditions are weak conditions. Case, okay, these type of things are not there. Very easy, non-procedural long ways. One or two or three lines of coding is there, simple. Now, yes, observe it here. Yes, once we are writing a what, this type of coding, this is called SQL long ways, then automatically it is affected in a where your database. Observe it here. Yes, your database. Yes, in a previous case, New York is there, but in this case, Hyderabad is a location is there or not? Yes. That's why always, always observe it here. And now here, Oracle is a Database product, what type of database means? Oh, maybe in a future relational databases. That's why structured collection of data it will be storing. But if you want to operate a want, these are relational, otherwise, what I kill database product, which languages we are using? Which languages in a non-technical person means slowly observe here? Which languages? Yes, one language is what? SQL. SQL means structured query language, not only that language. Some other language is there. What is that one means? Maybe. Anybody having idea technical programmers? PLSQL is a long way. In our course, that long way is also we are learning. PLSQL means same like a Java, same like a C, C++. So procedure long ways, concepts are there, variable, some little bit of coding, not a difficult, very easy only. PLSQL, so many jobs are there. You are uh, typing a what in a Google, PLSQL developer means so many jobs are there. Only PLSQL, little bit of SQL knowledge also guaranteed. 
that much of powerful observe it here yes if you want to operate a what oracle database product in our company side or anything just we are using a what we are learning a what which languages sql is a one language structured query language after sql we are learning means yes another language also better to learn that is what plsql procedural language extension for sql not only that one not only these two but also in a company side we are using a what another language here dynamic sql is a language dynamic sql that is a small one only because plsql we are good knowledge is there means a little bit of uh, extension is there dynamic sql language these three languages you have an idea and now here yes through these three languages we are operating a what this software only oracle software that is most powerful in a company side yes here little bit of sql knowledge is there little bit of plsql knowledge is there also we are operating but more things so we are learning means okay so now so many different different types of jobs are there that's why observed here oracle is a product from oracle corporation if you want to operate a what this relational database product means which languages we are learning one is sql language we are using otherwise learn again another one is plsql another one is dynamic sql these three languages we are learning a what in our course most powerful suppose here and uh, now here check it out here in this sql language for example uh yes this is another finished batch in sql so many ddl dml here creating a table these all the things are available in a way this is a sql language here some queries you are writing only okay fine what is this one in another batch completed means these all the things are there and now here these all the things how can i what is that one those all the things you are learning okay fine here select statement these are simple simple okay fine simple simple concepts only this queries you are writing suppose you are joining in a very java course or anything you are attending interview you are joining in a python course you are attending interview write a query to display and pay salary employee they are asking minimum basic knowledge is required in a front end programmer also in that case also these queries are helpful not only database programmer and now here observe here these type of concepts are there okay these all the things we are learning and now here main concept joins is a concepts retrieve data from multiple table this is sql logbooks knowledge maybe some fellows are having idea on it bro and now here then here constraints now so now here okay so now in our sql language side constraints is a concept is there here primary key foreign key check so many things are there okay fine once we are good at what those all the things you know, we are learning in our course here sub query is a concept is there most powerful yes query within another query but a little bit of uh, so one or two lines of coding only okay fine observe here in uh, okay fine observe it these all the things we are learning one of these days <clears throat> one minute only here these are main main chapter in a database also sub queries are there observe here sub queries these are most powerful in this chapter only we are learning about entry questions okay fine suppose you are you are attending a interview means uh, so now here display nth highest salary employee second highest salary employee uh, so delete duplicate rows so these type of things are there okay so those all the things we are learning about in our course only okay when is that one okay some some queries are there okay fine these are all the things we are familiar okay don't worry now then a database object so many things are there okay fine we are learning okay fine these are big concepts again plsql means some little bit of coding is there don't afraid only this is a plsql and now plsql means here this type of for some little bit of coding you are writing only here plsql is there in that one cursors exceptions stored procedures stored functions triggers packages types collections bulk bind ref cursors okay local sub programs util file packages sql loader external tables so, so many things only like this okay fine so many self syllabus is there that's why some concepts are there don't worry ha now here that's why yes sql language first we are learning after that one some knowledge you are getting only as uh, yes then okay then only they are learning about plsql through these two languages we are operating a what this oracle software okay na? yeah and now check it out observe it here <clears throat> okay but unfortunately so many fellows are thinking a what oh database means nothing is there some java dot net python application front end is there that data we are entering means the data is storing only storing purpose only they are thinking okay first time newcomer 
in a back end only they are storing a what a data purpose only storing data purpose only they are thinking but absolutely wrong one not only storing a what a data so many things are there what is that one actually databases means not only storing a what data but also yes the efficient way retrieval of data is important suppose for example screen observe it in a olden days 1960 before in a file format only they are storing a data like this in a future histories we are learning this is a file format also permanently storing a data but employee details are there here now who are the employees are joining a what yes before 1981 those employees information i want to retrieve means in a file from the file i want to retrieve the data means very difficult you are writing a c program java program dot net program python program we are writing a what then only file data we are retrieving only fetching that is very difficult a big big application programs we are writing only but unfortunately nowadays these type of database softwares are there for example nowadays these are relational database softwares now from these softwares for example somewhere data is there for example now check it out here observe it here somewhere data is there suppose here these are the employees are joining only i want to display the employees who are joining before 1981 some employees are joining only those employees i want details i want in my project means just here your sql programmer means somewhere data is there okay fine this data how they are fetching means just they are writing a what queries these are called queries observe it here select the star from table name where and uh, now here observe it here higher date like this only here less than or equal to here first january or anything for example or uh, now here check it out here 1981 like this only just they are writing the queries automatically data is displayed or not oh maybe some query you are writing a single line of coding then before 1980 who are employees or 1981 those employees automatically retrieved from the where database is possible or not that's why efficient way of the where data retrieval is most powerful how we are achieving means through these databases only possible through these languages only possible but unfortunately concentrate suppose first time newcomer means so many doubts only <clears throat> now what is those doubts means observe here concentrate through this simple example through the simple example today we are giving a what easiest way explanation only difference between some databases some languages so many fellows are confusing that i will tell you suppose for example slowly 5 minutes concentrate enough i am working in a company slowly observe here whenever i am working in a where company i have a doubt or you are, you are also having a doubt only i am working in a where oracle projects oracle is a relational database product okay fine if i want to operate a what this relational database product then i am using a what in my company side sql is a long ways observe here sql is a long ways i am using slowly observe here sql is a long ways okay fine suppose in my company another product another project also there that is also a relational database product that is from microsoft product that is sql server is a product observe here sql server who are what persons are working who are employees are working some employees are working in a where sql server product that is also database product same like our oracle but they want to operate a what that sql server they are using a what one long ways only what is that long ways sql is a long ways observe here sql is a long ways slowly observe here again here my sql is a what so many fellows are using in my company my sql is a database relational database product is there for example if they want to uh, now here yes operate a what this my sql database product that is also relational database product uh, yes in my company some employees are working in a my sql product that is open source only they are operating a my sql database also they are using a what sql is a long ways for example now here sql language is there there is a universal language now what is my doubt otherwise so many fellows are attending about this demo class they, those persons having a doubt only these all sql languages are same or different i have a doubt here now anybody anybody guess it only one answer is correct 
whenever you are working in your oracle database product in your system otherwise your friend is working in sql server product yes your other friend is working in a mysql database product these all persons are using a what a sql language only but these all sql languages are same or different only one answer is correct easy easy maybe some technical persons are there in our class they are telling only these all sql languages are same or different very good in our class so many fellows are telling a what same only they are telling 100% wrong one these all sql languages are different not same why so many students confusing only why so many students are telling a what yes so many employees are telling a what these all sql languages are same means maybe in your academic career side uh, maybe dbms theory some projects are there in that one maybe in it small small databases we are learning also in that one insert update delete select some commands are there in sql language those commands are maybe same commands only in our language that's why you are thinking about same but unfortunately these are totally different these all sql languages are different not same how you are given the guarantee these are different means simple technique is there what is that one means concentrate here now here concentrate here now check it out observe it here so many fellows are telling different only very good correct and now observe it here how we are telling a what you are given the guarantee these are different means simple technique what is the technique means you are a latest programmer through some knowledge only easily you are telling a what difference only that is you are keep it in mind means very easy way you are understandable this concept suppose so many object oriented languages are there okay little bit of knowledge is there in a technical okay object oriented languages are there in a worldwide maybe so many fellows have any idea no object oriented languages are there in a worldwide only okay fine what are the object oriented languages are there in a worldwide c++ is object oriented language in a java is a popular object oriented language in a c sharp .net only is a object oriented language in a c++ is a object oriented language that's why so many object oriented languages are there suppose two languages today i'm taking example through that one same concepts are there in a where and now same similar concepts through we are observing a what these all sql are different or same and now check it out suppose simple only 5 minutes observe it enough this is a demo no just observe it what is going on c++ is a language is there java is a language is there for example in a computer students are there those persons talks c++ is a language and also java is a long these are two object oriented popular object oriented languages in a object oriented languages some hoops concepts are there maybe object oriented features something is there no yes here also hoops concepts are there here also hoops concepts are there here hoops concepts means maybe some fellows having idea only which one a class is a concept is there again object is a what class concept is there again occasion inheritance is a concept is there observe it here again polymorphism is a concept is there maybe so many fellows having idea uh, now here roughly uh, now check it out in a technical persons are there observe it here same here also in a java also hoops concepts means uh, what is class okay fine what is object some concepts are there or not yes here what is inheritance okay fine yes here and uh, now here yes here again what is polymorphism so many concepts are there that's why conceptually class object inheritance polymorphism concepts only same okay c++ in a java okay conceptually what is class what is object what is inheritance what is polymorphism like this error encapsulation binding something okay but but observe it here anybody anybody guess it suppose in a c++ i want to create a object from the class means what is the syntax anybody anybody technical persons having idea so many persons persons are having idea i think creating a object creating a object from the class means what is the syntax in a c++ syntax syntax observe it here what is the syntax in a c++ yes so many fellows having idea how can i yes here suppose what is the syntax they are giving in a where in a c++ means class name slowly observe it here here only difference class name space object name this is a syntax to create a object from the class in a c++ suppose 
same creating object is there in a where in a java also and now here observe here suppose they want to create a object some objects class something is there don't worry what is that one creating a now just observe here creating a object from the where class in a where in a java anybody technical persons are there maybe tell me roughly syntax maybe so many fellows are good at what java python these languages in academic career no yeah so now here now tell me yes very good and now some fellows are telling correct class name okay class name space object name is equal to new class constructor some other syntax is there or not yes here observe here that's why these two languages are syntactically syntactically different or same different syntactically different observe here syntactically different conceptually oops concepts are same but here syntactically different and also functions also totally different suppose here in, in a c++ i want to display output me c out is a what a function is there streaming output only and now here yes in a java what is the function system dot out dot printl and something is there or not yes here that's why syntactically different yes here okay so now here yes functions also totally different in these two object oriented languages but conceptually some oops concepts are same or not same oops concepts are same what is class what is object what is generator what is polymerism same but syntactically totally different why because those are two different languages okay fine first of all two different products from the way different companies only and now that's why functions are different and also syntax is also different same like same like here also here also observe it here actually sql sql same thing sql is a ansi standard language sql is a american national standard institute defining a what some standards only in a sql language only that's why this is a sql is a ansi standard language okay ansi standard languages now from this ansi standard this ansi standard language used to operate all the relational databases i am agree but 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 unfortunately observe here from this ansi standard sql languages oracle corporation creating their own sql that is called oracle sql that is important that so many people sir doesn't know again again observe it here yes sql server microsoft product only creating a what their own sql from this ansi standard sql that is called sql server sql again mysql creating a what their own sql language only from this ansi standard that is called mysql sql that's why in our class we are learning a what oracle sql how you are differentiate these all the things means these all all the languages sql languages conceptually same conceptually means here table is there view is there procedure is there function is there trigger is there package is there in oracle sql here also sql server what is table what is view what is synonym what is the index what is a procedure what is the function what is the trigger same conceptually here mysql also table procedure function trigger package these are same conceptually but syntactically totally different first four or three syntax is same but totally syntactically different and functions also different functions also different means suppose in a null values we are handling means in a oracle side nvl is a function is there but same function i am using in a where in sql server working no not working why because that is a different language that's why in sql server is null is a function we are using only for handling a what and null values arithmetic operation of performed on null values again become null or something okay so here yes in a mysql same function i'm copying only i'm pasting in a where yes i'm writing coding means working no if null is there yes through that one only and now we are handling a what a null values arithmetic operations in a project that's why functions are totally different and version of here yes here syntactically totally different here create procedure syntax is different here create a procedure syntax is different here slight slight differences okay fine suppose some function is there months underscore between is there is that is in a oracle sql only but same function i'm using in sql server sql possible no there is date difference is there there is another function that's why always what we are learning means yes here sql is a ansi standard languages from that sql language we are creating a what oracle corporation creating a what sql their own sql language that is called oracle sql language 
That's why SQL is ANSI standard language conceptually same in every database conceptually. What is table? What is a procedure? What is a view? Like this only some concepts are there. What is joins? What is subqueries? What is the vocation or constraints? The same. Oh, what is what same? But syntactically totally different. Functions also totally different. That's why in our class, what we are learning, Oracle SQL language we are learning. Understood? Okay, so same like a Java, C++, object creation and conceptually you are, uh, uh, so now here thinking means, uh, now here check it out, okay, fine. And now here same thing only. These are Democrats, just idea purpose, maybe non-technical persons are there, no? Those things, person purpose, uh, we are telling about like this. Okay, I understood at least a small basic. Okay, fine. But uh, now something. Suppose why we are learning at these courses? Suppose what I kill database, otherwise SQL server, otherwise my SQL. What is the purpose we are learning actually? Yes, suppose you are a, a newcomer, I don't know. So otherwise you are an experienced person in a company. So I don't know. So now here recently passed out. So I don't know. Yes, what type of persons are learning in a worldwide, these type of softwares means, otherwise what I kill database software means, so many different type of persons. First, suppose student point of view, I'm telling you. Suppose so many students only observe it here, <clears throat> learning a courses in a front end. Nowadays, Python they are learning. Otherwise, they are learning about Java, these type of front end, otherwise .NET, ASP.NET, like this only, web-based applications and PHP, these type of front end applications, they are learning only. These persons, these are web-based application programmers. Okay, web-based are also possible in a Java or Python. Okay, yes. These type of web-based application programmers in a where, in a project side, compulsory minimum knowledge is required in a where database. Minimum knowledge. Why? Because now here, suppose Java programmers, JDBC project side, compulsory, they are using a what? Yes, database. This type of relational databases only. .NET programmers, ADO.NET is there in that one, they're using a what? So now here, yes, these type of databases. In that databases, minimum knowledge means here stored procedures is a concept is there that is a regularly used concept. That's why anybody, Java, .NET, these type of programmers attending interview, yes, so many fellows are asking, write a query to display entire salary employee, write a query to display the second salary employee, uh, what is join, uh, now with the write a query to delete duplicate rows from a table. Yes, here, so many predefined queries they're asking, at least minimum knowledge is there or not, they're checking out purpose, because these persons are also front-end developer programmers also, minimum knowledge is required, minimum. Either Oracle, either SQL server, either DB2, anything. Minimum knowledge is required. That's why maybe so many fellows are learning a courses like this. Okay, second, second point of view. Observe here, so many different, different type of persons are learning in a worldwide, this type of Oracle, what's, suppose Oracle course, okay, for example. Again, second type means, suppose so many fellows are struggling in a job. Suppose pressure level, they are unable to get a job. Maybe one or two years, maybe wasting. Okay, for example, maybe any reason, okay, not a problem. They're unable to get a job. Then those persons, yes, they're learning a what, they're applying a what in a way, in a company side. PLSQL developer is a job are there without any knowledge of the Java, .NET, print end. Maybe in a non-technical person, they are not very good knowledge in a way of programming skills. Then PLSQL developer jobs are there. Two years, three years gap is there maybe. And now here, yes, here. Two plus three, uh, two plus years, three plus years. Okay, some gap is there. Maybe, okay, fine. Those persons are in our course only. They are applying a what? This course, they are learning only PLS, well, developer purpose. They So many fellows are learning a what? Course from me. Okay, actually, I'm a senior most PLS, well, developer. That's why I'm very depth knowledge. I'm telling only in a PLS school, these persons are struggling in a way, I guess, maybe in a job searching only in that one PLS school, okay, thoroughly they, or they are learning from me. Okay, for example, like especially our, our concepts only, I'm telling in depth knowledge only where the interview, what is that one I know that those persons applying a what PLS school developer jobs also, so many fellow learning about this course. Because in this course, SQL also we are learning and PLSQL also we are learning or not? Yes, here. Again, observe it here. Yes, PLSQL developer jobs purpose. 
another type of persons suppose here <coughs> nowadays uh, so many uh, son of here persons are not uh, very good knowledge in a where uh, son of coding okay maybe in a nautical person they want they want to move into where in a software in that case one uh, okay son of one type of jobs are there what is that one means data warehousing technologies are there in that one etl programmers are there and reporting programmers are there e extraction transformation and loading etl tools are there these persons are little bit of sql knowledge pl sql is not required sql knowledge there having idea then they are learning a tools in a very in a in a in a institutes also informatica is a tool in a very popular tool only in a way again i know here that is etl tool in a where data stays is a what a popular tool is there again here talent this is a tool there these etl tools is graphical user interface they are learning means minimum knowledge is required in aspl that's why they are learning about these courses this jobs purpose also again yes business analysts are there that is a reporting programmer reporting tools they are learning on easy way they are getting a jobs only reporting tools are there so many reporting tools are there in a worldwide suppose in a oracle related means bos obi are uh, now here these type of tools are there nowadays tab you quick you so now here, these type of tools easy way so now here they are getting a what job means then a minimum basic sql knowledge is required those persons also they are learning a what yes here this courses only again uh, now here yes here suppose some uh, programmers yes here erp side they are interested oracle apps oracle apps is a what erp is there same like sap oracle application level is there these persons very good knowledge is required in a plsql those persons also learning a what these courses again obi programmers are there obi uh, now here yes this a product is there and uh, now here this with the plsql jobs are there those persons also learning a what like that these courses again that's what different different person suppose you are not interested in a where programming side now you want to administration side you want jobs only in that case dba courses are there or i kill dba sql server dba mysql dba database administration courses are there these persons also minimum minimum knowledge is required before they are okay, learning about those courses minimum sql knowledge is required these persons also learning about these type of courses that's why always once you are good at what uh, this oracle anywhere or not from me anywhere also we are learning means uh, anywhere also it is helpful either pure database programmer you are applying or uh, business analyst you are applying or reporting programmer nowadays power bi is there sql server related that uh, power bi also so no minimum sql knowledge is required so many fellows are not interested to learn sql server sql yes oracle sql only they are learning why because oracle sql is their learning means all the things are very easy because these are depth knowledge is there okay fine that's why most powerful and now that's why different now nowadays hadoop programmers or data science programmers those all the things minimum basic knowledge is required in a where sql that's why sql somewhere pl sql somewhere sql only that's why they are learning a what these type of courses in a different different types of jobs also we are applying on okay that's why <clears throat> now from my point of view here whenever in a course we are learning means depth knowledge is better okay fine because software means knowledge that's all okay, later only your uh, company says survey or anything means knowledge is required knowledge is most powerful that's why i am taking a more time more time in the sense uh, it will take a time from my batches only okay so now whenever sql pl sql these courses we are learning in our oracle only uh, it will take a time because slowly easily understandable purpose and uh, any non technical person also understandable based only all the things i am telling notes also i am giving in a uh, yeah, okay so daily whatever notes i am typing only okay and then you are writing more clearly you are understandable without any knowledge also not a problem okay that's why it take a time okay because i am interested in aware always uh, uh, more depth only okay yes here yeah. <clears throat> because once uh, i am giving a what something means your confidence level is there then you are learning your own way also learning not a problem because youtubes are there and anywhere so many videos are there because our videos are there in a previous batches there are, you are asking to so now your yes management only they are only giving okay not a problem you are observing a what some knowledge is there means your own way also you are learning because same thing i am typing all the things uh, there no yes you are understand 
but maybe so many fellows are daily they are attending the classes means easy way they are learning they are thinking otherwise self learning also better not at all because nowadays videos are there okay anywhere either odini okay so now here otherwise our classes otherwise anywhere knowledge is your own wish in a way also you are getting but first what is what you must familiar that's why these type of uh, sir introductions required only okay okay now duration is more than uh, Three months ago, okay. Four months, four months ago, we are taking one. Okay, that's all. Okay, now yeah. Uh, maybe okay. So now here in all batches, they are sending a what videos or anything. In this batch also, they are uh, giving. I think okay. Yeah. Uh, in a, in a class timings means six o'clock. Maybe four o'clock, five or six. Or these are batches are there. So many batches are there. In a six o'clock is okay. Six to seven thirty like. That. But first, we are taking us less time only. Once we are. Uh, Starting those are all the things again. Your installation process, all the things I will tell you. Okay, uh, first five days week is there, and later, uh, okay, so now there are six days also, Saturday also, Saturday. because so much of syllabus. On, okay, that's yeah, okay. Now, uh, anybody having a doubts because so many doubts are there, but anybody because non technical persons are there. Some what is this going on? They are not knowing those persons are there. And the doubt some is yeah. Uh, you want uh, okay, suppose you don't have an idea that much of time only you are learning. Uh, then maybe you are requesting a management in a previous batch videos are there you have to ask this maybe they are providing i think uh, okay yes you have to ask those person okay they my morally sir videos are there okay. yeah. my name is morally only okay no. in a olden days uh, okay in a net only my pdfs also there in a way 2010 onwards and I'm, I'm in tc i don't know okay yeah <clears throat> That's why in a net only Murli sir, PLS will know sir, whatever I can know means you are maybe 11G or 12C or anything they are putting okay, in a net only. This is also uh, your download. Okay, now, yeah. So confidence level is very important. Actually, all the knowledges we are learning on outside not so easy this is time based on actually that's why some up to job uh, how much knowledge is required that one we are learning then uh, through the net uh, through the these classes video classes through that one we are getting a lot uh, more knowledge only we are surveying in a college some colleagues are helpful or anything okay maybe six or okay six months or seven months we are struggling in our company uh, then the same thing uh, repeated but knowledge is more Oh, SQL is a common one. Okay, yeah. But uh, uh, syntax are different and also functions are different. Already I'm telling you. Yeah. A DevOps engineer, okay, a little bit of SQL, not a more SQL, not required. Yeah. <clears throat> okay. But here we are learning about a Pure database means uh, so much of knowledge we are telling only, we are giving only, but uh, little bit of, okay, based on your requirement, we have to take a want of that knowledge, okay? In this course, we are covering uh, SPL, PL, SQL, and dynamic SQL long term. Uh, yes, here, one of the stages, uh, history also we are telling, okay, one of the stages. <clears throat> okay, these type of histories also, or oh, maybe history is there. Okay, so now not a model sorry, history. History is there. Okay, now in a old and days flat file approach is there. How what are the drawbacks? Are there in the middle of the courses we are learning? Then what is a database? What is a okay, so now DBMS, RDBMS, what is the differences? These are all the things we are learning one of these days. Okay. 
okay na two or three days we are taking a demos better no first uh, you are comfortable or not you are only checking you are comfortable means you have to join otherwise not interested means better to go for another faculty because uh, some fellows or some okay lecturers are uh, taking your want time only okay na? okay na? but it will take time tomorrow i will tell you some other concepts okay yeah this is a demo so okay don't worry okay na? thank you thank you so much tomorrow i will tell you everything thank you these are demo classes just some some concepts i am telling okay na? Yeah. one or two days not a problem uh, installation all the things i will tell you don't worry okay na? Thank you. Thank you so much. Tomorrow I will continue. Thank you. Tomorrow at 6 p.m. Okay? Na? Yeah. Thank you. These are the demo classes, not a actual sessions only. Just idea purpose, some concepts, idea purpose. I am telling only those things. Maybe one or two days or two or three days. That's all. You know. <clears throat> Actually, anybody not attending your what yesterday class also, not a problem. Just observe it. What I am telling about yesterday means small concept I am telling. Oracle is a product from Oracle Corporation. But what type of product this one? Database product. What is the version we are learning in our course means 19C is a version in this DB product only. What is this database means? <clears throat> Once we are installing a what Oracle software, automatically some place is created in a where in a disk only. In this place, uh, permanently we are storing a what a data. But unfortunately, these type of databases are relational databases. 1970 onwards, these database softwares are available. These relational databases does not store random collection of data. These relational databases only stores structured collection of data. Yesterday, I'm telling. Suppose this is a Oracle database is there. Database is some place. Now observe it here. Here, a structured collection of data we are storing only in this place. A organized fashion only. Actually, EF code introduced this relational data model concept based on that one, these type of databases they're implementing in a different, different companies. Actually, EF code is a mathematician, he is working in an IBM company. That's why he decided to store the data or representing the data in the format of matrix. Matrix are nothing but in a mathematics side, everyone knows rows and columns are there or not. That's why here structured collection of data is storing. this data using SQL is a long ways, structured query long ways. Yesterday up to this one, I am telling. Small thing I am telling only. That's why what I am telling about yesterday, if you want to operate, yes, this Oracle, this Oracle software, we are using SQL structured query long ways. Another long ways is what? PL SQL procedure long ways extension for SQL. Another long ways is dynamic SQL. Through these three languages, we are operating a what? This Oracle software in your companies. Okay, now? Up to this one small thing I'm telling, but unfortunately, some fellows are asking first time newcomer, Murli sir, SQL means or oh, maybe some commands only insert, update, delete, some small, small commands are there. That is maybe, uh, so now we are also familiar. But why this PLSQL is a some programming same like a C, C, Java, same like a those type of languages, 
Some language is there, they are telling only some pillows. That is PLSQL only, procedural language extension for SQL. Why this language is required really? Really, so many jobs are available in a where in a PLSQL also. Why this language is required means so many applications. Now, for example, you are a first time newcomer means how you are understandable means concentrate here. Why PLSQL required means just idea purpose, some applications I'm telling you. Slowly observe it here. Daily, so many fellows are going to wear banks for depositing money or withdrawing money or anything. Suppose I am also, you are also daily going to wear banks means ATM machines are there. From ATM machines, we are withdrawing your money or nowadays deposit machines also there are not. Yes, we are depositing a money. Some transactions we are performing, money transfer also possible. Now check it out. Slowly observe it here. Screen observe it. Suppose in this database, observe here, bank is a table is there, for example. Slowly observe it here. Concentrate here. Just observe the scenario. Very easy way, understandable. This is a bank is a table is there. In a table format only, we are storing the data in a feature. Suppose this is a, in a bank, for example, SBI bank is there. In this bank only, this is a data. Observe here, these are columns, account number, name, and balance. These are called columns. Here, these are 1001 something is there. No? These are called rows or data. Suppose this data, observe it here one minute only. 1001 is an account number. My name is Morley. I'm an account holder. My balance is how much? Yes, how much? 3,000 is there. Observe it here. My presently, my balance is 3,000 is there, for example. Now check it out scenario. Slowly observe it here. This is an ATM machine is there, for example. Slowly. One scenario I'm telling enough. Now check it out. This is an ATM machine is there. Now, what is my balance in my account? 3,000 is a balance is there. Observe here. Oh, maybe my balance is 3,000, for example. Today, I am decided to withdraw some amount only, for example. Suppose here, I am going to wear bank. Observe here. Slowly observe here. This is easily understandable. This small scenario. In a non-technical person also understandable. I am going to wear so now ATM center, for example. I decided to withdraw money. For example, I'm inserting a what ATM card. It will ask a pin number. I'm not checking a what balance. For example, for example, I'm not checking a what balance. But unfortunately, my balance is how much? 3,000 rupees are there presently in my account. Now, I decided to so withdraw some amount. Okay, fine. But unfortunately, 3,000 is my balance is available also. Whenever I'm inserting a, oh, sorry, an ATM card after, enter amount, it will be asking or not. In that case, maybe unfortunately, I mentally decided to withdraw 9,000 rupees. For example, for example, whenever I try to withdraw what 9,000 rupees, now as an, I am try to, I try to withdraw 9,000 rupees. Now I'm getting about 9,000 rupees. No. Here my balance is 3,000, but how I can get it? Okay, so 9,000 rupees impossible. In this case, it will give us a message. You are observing or not, your ATM missions, yes, maybe some messages it will be displayed. Suppose insufficient funds, something is a message or not. Oh, maybe, why? Because uh, now here, yes, here your balance is low, 3,000, but you are trying to retrieve what more than 3,000, that is 9,000, 8,000, 7,000 like this. How it is possible? In that case only, insufficient funds is a message, it will be displayed. But how it is possible, this message, this message, because ATM center knows? No. Actually, same like you only, some software engineers writing a coding, that is important. They are writing a what? Coding only. That coding, they are writing in a way where PLSQL is a long way. Suppose Oracle projects means, banking projects means, the Oracle means they are writing in a PLSQL. Or maybe what is the conditions? If user entered amount, 
is more than available balance then this message they are writing same like a java c c++ some coding is there if conditions they are writing like that otherwise how it is possible again another scenario for example now here your your balance is sorry my balance is what 3000 is there suppose i try to withdraw suppose i am inserting a what atm card now i try to withdraw 2000 rupees for example now possible possible why because here my balance is 3000 yes <coughs> i try to retrieve what yes here 2000 means 2000 less than the where what 3000 or not that's why this is try to retro means possible we are withdrawing a money or 2000 possible in this example side now whenever we are withdrawing a what 2000 now available balance is how much yes here 3000 minus 2000 that is a 1000 that is i want to affect in my database Otherwise, 2,000 you are withdrawing, still remaining, okay, 3,000 is available, means total banking system is collapsed or not. Those are all the transactions, how they are writing, coding through their writing only. They are writing a what? Coding. That's why these type of coding writing purpose, a PLSQL developers are required in a project side. Suppose, for example, and now here, check it out. For example, this is a bank is a table. Don't write it, okay, anything. Why? Because you don't have an idea. Just observe it. Oh, maybe some scenario. I mean, my interest purpose, I'm writing. I'm experienced person. I'm writing anything. And now suppose, observe it here. Bank is a table. Is there no only logically observe it enough? Bank is a simple scenario. Bank is a table. In this bank table, I try to withdrawing a what? Some money only. That purpose, I'm writing a what? Some coding in a PLSQL. Observe it here. What I am writing means that coding, you don't have an idea also. Logically observe it here, really correctly working or not, check it out. Don't write it. Suppose stored procedures is a concept is there. Actually, in a Java, .NET, Python, these persons also, in a MySQL, SQL Server, these type of language side, Oracle side, stored procedures is a concept is there. In that stored procedures only, these type of logical conditions they are writing. That is in our course, PLSQL side. Suppose, for example, check it out. Observe it here. I am an experienced person. Suppose in a future, you are also learning a course. Means you are also writing like this coding. Don't write it. Just observe it only. These are demo, no? just idea purpose. I am writing a procedure. Okay. Don't write it only. Create or replace procedure. What happened? Observe it here. Just executions. Here, I am giving a what? My procedure name is a what? Withdraw is a procedure. Okay, fine. Slowly observe here. This is a table is there. In my project, I try to one scenario. I try to implement a one small scenario only withdraw. Actually, big, big packages in this package, withdraw, deposit, all the things they are writing in a real time. But unfortunately, some small task only I'm giving in a procedure. Now here, create a replace procedure withdraw. Suppose here, I'm passing a what account number. Okay, fine. Account number I'm passing. Again, amount also I'm passing only because I try to withdraw. The ATM card is there, no? Same like. And now here, amount. Here, I'm passing a what? Something only. Okay. Now, some coding is there. I want to find out a balance. Now, whenever we are inserting a what? ATM card, then we are trying to retrieve. Check the balance, no? Yeah. Now, check it out. Concentrate here. Some coding is there. Select a balance. Here into V underscore balance, something is there from bank. These are all the things you don't have an idea, but logically observe it here where account number is equal to something. Okay, fine. These are all the things very easy actually. Suppose observe it here. Oh, suppose bank is a table is there. That table here, yeah, this is a table format only your transactions are storing. This table I'm using in a way in this PLS skill code. Here I'm checking whenever balance is there, my balance I'm checking only account number through. If whenever I'm inserting a ATM card, I try to withdraw 9,000 in a previous case. No, that's why that is an amount only. Suppose here that amount, logically observed here, not according. Here that amount is here less than the where available balance. And now here available balance, then I want to affect a what that one in a where in a database update table name set here 
balance is equal to balance minus p underscore amount something is there where coding is there okay fine now check it out some coding is there here i am writing a what some message same like a java.net some messages i try to display your transaction is successful transaction transaction successful Don't worry this one, just observe it here. Else, simple coding, some coding is there. And now check it out. Here, <clears throat> and now check it out here. Insufficient funds, no? Else, insufficient funds. Okay, some codings are there, okay. This is not a difficult coding, that easy. And now check it out, something they are writing a procedure, for example, this is called, observe it here, some coding I'm writing, you know, this is not a difficult coding, very easy coding, you are also in a, in a software knowledge, you don't have an idea also, you are writing in a future, because I will tell you all the things only. These type of codings are called PLSQL coding, same like a little bit of coding, programming is there, no? yes, here, PLSQL coding only. Once I'm developing about this procedure, withdraw procedure, I try to check, really, yes, whatever ATM transactions I'm telling in a previous case, that I try to check. Now check it out, observe it here. I try to check something is there, and uh, now here, observe it here. Here, I'm executing EXEC procedure name, withdraw, okay, fine. I'm calling a what this procedure, withdraw, what is these all the things you don't have an idea also, just observe it here, withdraw is there or not, that is the name of the my program I'm giving only, okay, fine. Here, yes, my account number 1001, account number I'm passing, comma, yes, I try to withdraw 9,000 rupees, for example, observe it here. My account number here in this table, observe it here, slowly observe it here, scenario observe it logic, 1001 is a my account number, morally my name only. Here, now my balance is how much? 3,000 in my table, 3,000 is a current balance is there. Now, my account number 1001, yes, but I try to withdraw how much amount? 9,000 I try to withdraw because this program I'm writing only, don't worry. Whenever 9,000 I try to withdraw is possible? No. So now here it will give us a what? Yes, message, insufficient funds. It will display message or not. How it is possible? This coding is executed. Whatever I'm writing that is executed. Oh, maybe your amount is more than the available balance. That's why insufficient funds only. It will display message or not? Yes. Now, suppose here, for example, uh, now logical observed here. Oh, maybe insufficient funds is a message. It will be displayed or not? Yes. Suppose here, now check it out. Another case, OTP validation. Those are all the things, same thing. And uh, now here, check it out. For example, in this case, here my balance is 3000, for example. Now I try to withdraw 2000 rupees, for example. And now here, check it out. Here, observe it here. Now 1001 is my account number. I try to execute again, withdraw. Okay, so now here, procedure. Now I try to withdraw 2000 rupees. Possible? Possible. Why? Because here my balance is, okay, 3000, but I try to withdraw what? 2000 only possible. So now whenever your passed amount, that is about 3,000, okay, less than 2,000 is less than the where available balance, in this case, 3,000. Here, here, this is a 2,000, less than the where 3,000. I am updating a what bank table only. Bank updating is modify that one. Just transaction is successful. Now, really correct? Now, whenever I'm executing, I want this one automatically, yes. Transaction successful, it will display. Oh, maybe you are try to withdraw about 2,000 rupees from the where, yes, 3,000 rupees. Yes, maybe possible or not, transaction is successful. How it is possible? Here I'm writing a what? Coding only. Now, really, that is affected in a where, in a table or not, compulsory in a database, it is affected. Then only your transaction, your banking system is okay, so now successful. And now check it out. Really, that is correct. In my bank table, I try to up observe it so now here yes bank is a table is there now check it out yes here oh maybe in a previous case 3000 is there 3000 minus 2000 rupees okay for example rupees i try to withdraw then automatically remaining balance how much 1000 rupees are there or not 
yes how it is possible you are a programmer you are writing a coding in a update update is a sql command only if condition is a pl sql command that's why yes you are good at what some language knowledge means those type of uh, these type of pl sql coding knowledge means then only you are writing a what in a real time applications otp validation some bus ticket reservation anything okay so many applications are there but little bit of knowledge is required Okay, now understood? Yes. And uh, now here, check it out. Slowly observe here, slowly. Uh, now, okay, PLSQL coding, some pillows are asking. That's why I'm showing only that one. Just observe it here, observe it here. Actually, these relational databases are there. Oracle, SQL Server, DB2. These are relational databases. Okay, databases, for example. But unfortunately, these databases having a what? Two types of structures are there. That is, you must be familiar before we are starting our courses. These databases, observe it here, two types of structures are there. Two types of structures. Don't write it, just observe it here. Two types of structures. One is, maybe anybody having an idea? Suppose Oracle you are taking, SQL Server you are taking, MySQL you are taking, DB2 you are taking, any relational databases, softwares you are installing in your system also, two types of structures are there. One is logical structure. One is logical structure. Logical structure. Database means it is a place where we can store structure. Okay. So here one is logical structure. Another one is physical structure, physical, physical structure. Before we are going to tell what is the logical and what is the physical structure in every these type of database software side, just a database definition in a books we are referring means so many fellows are writing like this. This is what is that one today, at least you are understandable. What is database means, and now here, anybody observing a what in a Google or in a books means, it is a place, don't read it. It is a, it is a place, it is a place where we can store, computer system, where we can store structured collection of data. They are telling only where we can store structured collection of data, structured collection of collection of data, what is data, what is information, what is DBMS, that is later, okay, structured collection of data, okay, observe here, actually, whenever we are installing a what, this type of what I kill or in a relational database software means, what is database actually, it is a place, whenever we are installing a this type of software means, automatically some place is reserved in a hard disk only, in that place only where we can store structured collection of data, okay, fine. But whenever we are installing a what these type of softwares means two types of structures are there. One is what logical structure. Another one is what physical structure. This definition I am not explaining today. You are understandable one of these days. Now observe it. First two types of structures are there. One is logical structure. Another one is physical structure. Anybody in our class, maybe computer students are there, maybe academic career side, okay, there, DBMS, uh, some theories, their database management system is a paper, is there, I think, MTech, MCA, BTech, BCA, these type of persons, Miss MSC computers, these type of persons, tell me briefly, what is the difference between logical and physical structure? Anybody have an idea? Easy, not a difficult. What is logical structure? What is physical structure? And now here, yes, what is logical structure? What is physical structure? Anybody, anybody? Okay, some fellows are telling logical structure means logical structure, physical structure means physical structure only, they are telling only, no, don't uh, try to, uh, now here, yes, tell like that, okay? Yes, here. What is logical? What is uh, physical means? Very easy. Nothing, nothing, very easy. Otherwise, suppose maybe you are a Java, Python, or Oracle, otherwise I am a PLSQL developer. We are all basic level programmers means we are all working in a way, which structure maybe uh, in a Oracle or SQL or MySQL, in a which structure we, we are all working? Very good. Logical structure. Very good. Some pillars are telling logical structure only. Yes. What is that logical structure? Okay, logical structure only. Okay, really, I am also working in a logical structure. You are also working in a logical structure. You are a Java.net front-end programmer also working in a logical structure. I'm agree. 
logical structure of the database. But what is that logical structure? Suppose in a DBA persons are there, those persons are working in a physical structure, don't worry. Uh, but what is that logical structure at least? Yes, uh, logical structure means nothing is there. Very easy. Uh, now here, check it out. Slowly observe it here. What is a logical structure means easily understandable. Now observe it here. Suppose today, <clears throat> this is a Oracle. I'm installing, for example, okay, fine. Already I'm installing, okay, fine. In this uh, Oracle software side, observe here, this is a Oracle. In this Oracle, I try to create a table. Maybe bank is a table, is there no? Okay, in a previous case, bank is a table, is there no? These tables, uh, okay, so now already I'm creating in another class's side already. How I'm creating a what this table means, some syntaxes are there, don't worry, SQL language is there. Same like today, I'm creating a one table, for example. Don't write it, create table, any, any table, A, B, C, X, Y, Z. Otherwise, today is a table name, for example. Okay, sir. Today is a table name I'm giving anything. Okay, fine. Okay, some syntax I know. That's why I'm creating a one table. Slowly observe it here. Yes, concentrate here. Or maybe this table also there. And now here, anything also. Uh, suppose Z, 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 Z is a table is there. Observe here. Z, 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 Z is a table is there. For example, I am creating. Okay, fine. For example, this table is created. Slowly observe here. Z, 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 Z is a name I am giving. In a name. Okay, fine. The table I am creating only in my Oracle database or SQL Server database or MySQL database. I am creating a table. Okay, fine. Table is created. Okay, fine. Table is created. Slowly observe here. This table is created, okay. Now I'm interested to view this table is created or not in my operating system. Suppose Windows operating system is there. Where the Oracle is there, okay, I'm already installing a Oracle. In that location, I try to view, for example, suppose in a C colon, D colon, <coughs> where the Oracle is there, here, the Oracle is there, here. Those all, okay, directories, don't worry. These are folders. Here, what I kill, what I data, what I CL. I'm observing only. And now, in a C colon, I'm installing my Oracle software. In this Oracle software, here, 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 anywhere, Z, 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 Z table is visible or not visible? Anybody, anybody guess? Otherwise, anybody observe it here? Now, I am creating already table Z, 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 Z table. Table is really created. Now, where the Oracle is there in my operating system, in a C drive only, in my class only, here in this system, yes, in, within a C drive only, yes, this Oracle is available. Now, in that location, I try to observe where the table is available, I'm observing only, really created, okay, in our disk only. But I try to observe the what, where the table is available, I'm observing only in this location. But unfortunately, here, here, Z, 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 Z is a table I'm giving only that a table is visible in operating system or not visible? Very good. Not visible. You are observing you are not. This is not visible. That's why a structure which is not visible in operating system, in operating system, OS, oh yes, in operating system, that is called a logical structure. Very, very important. Tables are not visible in a where in a C drive, D drive like that. Views does not visible in a where in a C drive, D drive, E drive like this. In a indexes, in a functions, in a procedure, not visible. That is visible in a database. Okay, I'm agree. But unfortunately, that is not visible in operating system. That's why, uh, now what is a logical structure means, don't write it, a structure, uh, now here, a structure, which is not what structure, the database structure, don't worry. A structure which is not visible, which is not visible in operating system in OS, in operating system is called, is called, is called logical structure, logical structure, logical structure of the database. That's why you are creating a table also that is we are unable to view in a C drive, D drive like that only. 
but where it is visible yes in a where in a database this is a database only don't worry in this database only it is visible okay so now those tables are visible in a where in a database okay there is not a visible in a where in your and now here c drive d drive like that only that's why a structure which is not visible in operating system is called logical structure but in this logical structure only a developers are working suppose i am a pl sql developer your sql developer java developers dotnet developers python developers etl developers these all persons are working in a logical structure that logical structure contains tables are there in a oracle or sql server also tables are there mysql also tables are there View Views are there. Yes, your synonyms are there. Indexes are there. These all the database objects. So many things are there. Procedures are there. Functions are there. Triggers are there. Packages are there. So many things only. These are all logical related, logical structure that is not visible in aware. Whatever courses we are learning in aware, so many objects that is not being in aware in operating system. Now, now observe it here. What is physical structure? Don't write it. Uh, now check it out. Just roughly observe it here. Physical structure is there. Physical structure. Now just idea purpose only. What is a physical structure means? Uh, now this is opposite only. A structure which is visible in operating system. So now here, don't write it. Observe it here. A structure, a structure which is, which is, uh, now here, which is visible which is visible in operating system, which is visible in OS operating system is called, is called, is called, yes, here physical structure is called physical structure. What is this one? Who are the persons are working in aware in this physical structure means observe it here. It's a big, big concept. Just, okay, definition side, I'm telling only because what is database today? I'm telling only which definitions is correct. I will tell you. Now check it out. A structure which is visible in operating system is called physical structure. Suppose I am installing, you are installing in a software also, some physical files are created in a disk. Suppose your PowerPoint, MS, Access, ABS, Word, anything we are loading also, physical files are created. Same like in our software, Oracle is a, a relational database software, MySQL, SQL Server, we are installing, for example. Whenever I'm installing a what, installing, so now here, yes, in a way, Oracle, automatically physical files are created. Some physical files are created, some physical files that is called data files are created, a dot .dbf files, control files are created, and also read or log files are created. These are all the things you don't have an idea. In a future, DBA concept, this one actually, roughly introduction I'm telling in our course side. Observe here, whenever I'm installing a what, a Oracle software, for example, is automatically some files are created in a disk. Observe here, in a C drive, D drive, some files are created here, observe here. These are data files, dot dbf files, something, okay, fine. What is this one? You don't have an idea, later you have to Your control files, in a read or log files, these files are, these files, that's why a structure which is visible in operating system, or oh, maybe some files are visible or not, that is called a physical structure. But the physical structure, you are working, I am working, no. Yes, okay, some different type of persons are working. What is that one means? DBA, database administrator. Actually, in a where project side, database, database administrator, some other type of persons are there in a database. Those type of persons, database administrators only, administrators only working in a where, DBA persons only working in a physical structure. Suppose I am a I am a Oracle DBA programmer, for example. Okay, I am learning Oracle DBA, for example. DBA course is there, don't worry. Backup, okay, so now here, recovery. So many things are there in that one table spaces, segments, so many, okay, don't worry. Suppose I am Oracle DBA, I'm learning a course, for example, anywhere. Oracle DBA course is there because I'm interested to apply anywhere. Oracle DBA job only in a where in a company, for example. Whenever I'm applying a what, so now your job in a where Oracle DBA course I'm learning, I'm applying a job Oracle DBA means I'm attending an interview, observed here, interview. Roughly my interviewer asking a what, morally what is database, they're asking. What is database, they're asking. 
whenever they are asking uh, what what is database means i am telling uh, what oh it is a bookish knowledge it is a structure collection of interrelated data that is stored in a where okay structure okay structure okay so no structured collection of data it is a place only it is stores a uh, what structure collection of data i am telling means immediately rejected immediately why because this is developer definition developers are logically they are good that is a table that is nothing but a what a structured collection of data they have an idea that's why i am also you are also telling structured collection of data yes maybe over their point of view or maybe not a problem they are thinking only okay easy way okay they are telling only logical way but they are understandable but unfortunately whenever dba person means the those persons are different knowledge only that's why these persons what is a database they are asking what interviewer means yes i am a dba programmer means i am not telling what it is a place which stores a what structured collection of data means wrong, wrong one that is a logical side i am not telling only i am telling a what yes physical side whenever i am installing a what oracle software automatically some physical files are created in a disk that is visible that is a what uh, observed here data files control files read log files are there or not that's why what i am telling why my database administrator means what is a database means it is a collection of yes data files control files read log files and that is original there is a physical place in a sql drive d drive really here only data is storing only that's why what is a database they are asking me is database administrator telling it is a physical side they are telling only because they are working the well known persons what is data files what is read log files what is control files what is the devocation of your relation between logical and physical those are all the things they have an idea that's why it is nothing but a what collection of data files control files read log files they are telling only that is correct answer in a database administrator point of view suppose here i am a developer i am not a administrator for example so now here i am a developer i am a java developer i am a sql developer pl sql developer i am a so now here yes python developer like that these developers attending a interview what is database okay for example they are not asking but generally okay so now here what is database they are asking means yes here the developers are telling a what a logical structure wise they are telling that's why logical structure wise they are telling what they are telling yes it is a place where we can store structured collection of data this is a structured collection of data or not okay table for Uh, suppose yesterday anybody observing or not a big big table i'm typing only here like this it is a structured collection of data is there or not this is the logical side we are telling what or table format because tables views procedures functions triggers these persons developers are well known persons oh maybe database is a place it is a it, it stores a what a structured collection of data because the relational database side logical side we are learning only. that's why in a books we are referring means in a google we are typing or what what is a database means two definitions are there we are observing or not but most of the developers are writing or what it is a place where we can store structured collection of data understood yes that's why <coughs> now here this is a oracle is a product from oracle corporation in our course we are learning about a 19c version only in this one this is a database product this database what is a database they are asking anybody asking me we are a developer how we are telling it is a place where we can store structured collection of data there is a logical side we are telling what is the purpose of databases means not only storing a what a data permanently but also we are efficient way we are retrieving the data fetching the data from the where some place only if you want to operate this oracle software we are we are using a what sql PL SQL and the dynamic SQL languages. In a way, we are learning a Oracle course. Means these three things they are telling only. Okay, na yes, here that is a very small thing I am telling only. Okay, <clears throat> now here, now check it out. Observe it here. Suppose in a screen only <clears throat> here. Anybody observe it? What is this one? in my screen only something is there maybe what is this one 
I am ministering over Akel. What is this one? SPL plus is there. What is this one? SPL is a long ways yon idea. Okay, fine. Long ways yon idea. PL SQL is a long way. Some coding is there. Dynamic SQL is a long ways. Daily we are writing a coding. But unfortunately, yes, here, another thing is there in my system here. SQL plus is there. What is this one? Means this is a tool. This is called a client tool. If you want to connect to Oracle database, then we are using a what a client tools. SQL plus is a tool that is a default tool. Whenever I'm installing a what a Oracle software, automatically the tool is available. How can you install? What is that one? What is these tools? We are learning in our course. Don't worry. This is a Oracle software I'm installing in that one here automatically SQL plus tool is there. Daily through this tool, through we are interacting with the server. That is a Oracle database is there. No, that server we are interacting with. Those are all the things in our course side we are learning. What is this tool? What is that server? How it will be connected? What is the username? What is the password like this? SQL plus is a tool is there. This is a default tool. Again, SQL developer is a tool is there. SQL developer is a tool is there. That is a GUI tool. That tool also you are installing, not a problem. Again, SQL Navigator is a tool is there. Toad is a tool is there. Those are all the tools, explicit tools. That is a GUI tools. But this is SQL plus you are not required to load. Once we are loading a what, what I can software, automatically that SQL plus tool is available. Those are all the things one, one of these days we are starting our course, then you are understandable. Okay, na? those are all the things in our course only we are learning. Okay, na? just okay, small, small concepts. I am telling only why I am telling about today's only small concept. Me tomorrow there is no class because Saturday <coughs> some newcomers are coming in Monday. That's why <coughs> more things I am not telling about today. Okay, anybody having a doubts? Then uh, I'm taking a what Monday also a small demo maybe okay so now, then we are starting a what again classes maybe Monday or Tuesday or class okay yeah anybody having a doubts logical physical uh, both the things are relation they don't okay after one or two days after actual classes you are starting don't worry. <coughs> And now we are not taking our offline classes. Why? Because because of virus only so many fellows are afraid. That's why. Okay, yeah. <clears throat> uh, okay, Sunday classes are not there. Okay, maybe in a syllabus based on the syllabus only. Sunday also sometimes we are taking. Okay, easily you are understandable very easy okay because practically once you are starting means you are understandable don't worry is all the demo class means anything I can okay yeah oh yes they are able batch also videos are there no so now those are recorded videos also they are setting maybe you ought to ask in our management Every batch of uh, some previous batches installation also I will tell you. Class is one and a half hour actually, but first we are taking one hour when we are closing space. Okay, now, otherwise uh, you want to so know the syllabus and all these things, previous uh, batches uh, records uh, recorded videos are there. You have to request means maybe in management where some. Data science for uh, person's purpose, a uh, little bit of knowledge is enough. Okay, yeah. Different, different type of persons, different knowledge is required in SQL. Minimum basic. Okay, yeah. 
tomorrow there is no class first time no yes saturday there is no class monday will come okay na batch time in this stage to sir okay but there are come to some stages anybody okay so now uh, interested to attend a what uh, uh, another day more regular sessions means morning batches are there in a way 7 to 8 to 9 to 9 to 10 to 11 something is there <clears throat> and also you need four five batches are A DevOps engineer side, more knowledge is not required. Basic SQL is enough. More things they are not uh, using only basic. Full stack developers and the DevOps. These persons are basic knowledge. Up to some queries, I am telling only something. Uh, then uh, you are attending up to that one. Then you recorded videos. You are listening also enough. etl developers means always sub queries joins material like reviews indexes partitions some concepts are required olap features rank dense rank this type of analytical functions lag and lead analytical functions some analytical functions only some knowledge is required and the pls to store for some time this before 10 am three batches are there don't worry because already some syllabus is going on developer developers also minimum basic Morning also some batches going on, but some syllabus is already the middle of these syllabus is there. Okay, na yes. Monday, yes. We'll continue on Monday. Okay, na yes. Tomorrow don't attend the class. Monday will continue. Okay. first time no? yeah not a problem because these are demos monday will continue thank you <clears throat> monday will continue tomorrow there is no class monday will continue recorded videos those all the things you have to ask management only they are sent okay na no? thank you tomorrow tomorrow there is no class monday will continue thank you <clears throat> management means maybe some numbers they think i think otherwise uh, in a net only so the details are there so to call to the persons <coughs> they are only sending in every batch of these all the previous videos so. in a website to the soft okay so no numbers are there no go to call okay now this is very easy database software learning nothing nowadays you are a latest programmer means this is nothing really compared to java dot net python this is very easy otherwise you have to observe the what a youtube so before we are joining uh, these courses in you know, in youtube so okay what i can related or anything then you are understand oh maybe this much of easy something then practically means nothing is there okay na monday will continue thank you Here these are demo classes. Maybe la this is the last demo class. Otherwise, one or two classes actually. And actually, what I can any newcomers miss concentrate. Previous class demo classes, small small things actually. What I can is a product from what I can corporation. What type of product that one? Database product. What is the purpose of the where database products? 
either Oracle, either SQL Server, either DB2, so many products are there. What is the purpose of these database products means for storing data. Now, for storing data permanently in hard disk, in a secondary storage devices otherwise. But not only permanently storing the data, but also efficient way of retrieving the data. But unfortunately, what I'm telling in a previous classes, slowly observed here, database means it is a place. Whenever we are installing a Oracle SQL Server DB, these type of databases we are installing in our system automatically when this is created, that is called database. But unfortunately, these type of databases, Oracle, SQL Server, DB2, Sybase, these type of databases does not store random collection of data. These type of databases only stores structured collection of data, organized fashion only data is storing. Why? Because these type of databases or relational data model is a concept is there today, I will tell you. Relational data model is a concept is there based on that one only that implementing what these type of products only. These are really, they're called as relational databases. Subject here, structured collection of data is there. Structured collection of data. This is previous class I'm telling. Structured collection of data. Always these type of databases stores structured collection of data. Organized fashion only data is storing. Once a structured collection of data is there for handling, for operating this data, using a what, a which long ways, very good. SQL structured query long ways. That's why these type of databases are implemented based on relational data model. What is that one today? I will tell you. Now here, these type of databases, that is what I call SQL Server, DB2, Sybase, MySQL, these all the databases are implemented based on relational data model, some concept only. Today I will tell you. For operating that data model products, then we are using SQL. But unfortunately, what I kill long, what I kill database product, if you want to operate means three languages we are using. One is SQL, another one is PLSQL, another one is dynamic SQL. Up to this one in a previous classes we are learning. Okay.
Hello, 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 hello. Can you hear me now? Hello, hello. Some network member, maybe. Hello, 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 hello. Hello, 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 hello. Yeah, and now here, maybe there's an online class now. Some network problem occurred. Okay, yeah, now check it out. Concentrate here. What I am telling anybody not attending the previous classes, don't afraid on it, don't worry. Simple, Anna Varakil is a product from Varakil Corporation. 19C is a version, don't worry. This Varakil is a database product. Okay, fine. This is a database product only. Previous class notes. Okay, just idea purpose. Newcomers for database product. What is the purpose of this database for product means for storing data permanently in a hard disk. But these type of databases, Oracle, like SQL Server, DB2, these type of databases, MySQL, Teradata, these all databases from different, different companies. Okay. But these databases are implemented based on relational data model is a concept is there. Don't worry. Today, I'm telling that one. That's why these databases only stores a structured collection of data. Suppose observe it here. Structured collection of data means stable format only data is available. Observe it here. A organized fashion only data is storing. Okay. Yeah. Now for operating a water. So now these type of relational data model products, one universal language is there. What is that one? Yes, SQL is a language, structured query language. But Oracle product we are operating means not only SQL language, three languages are there. One is SQL, another one is after SQL, PLSQL is there, procedural language extension for SQL. Another one is dynamic SQL. Anybody learning a Oracle course in a worldwide, anybody also, anywhere also, not from me only, anywhere also they're learning means, yes, in that course, they're telling about these three languages. What is SQL language? What is PLSQL language? What is dynamic SQL? Big, big concepts only. These are all the things we are learning means through these languages, we are operating about these type of products only. Okay, otherwise Oracle product, okay, fine, in your company. Okay, up to this one in a previous class I am telling. Now concentrate here. Actually, <clears throat> now slowly observe it here. This is a demo class, something I am telling only. Oracle is a product from Oracle Corporation. Don't read it today. SQL Server is a product from Microsoft. Yes, MySQL is a open source product. That is also now from Oracle. Again, Teradata is a product from NCR Corporation. Again, Sybase is a product from Ingress software. Okay, like this only so many products are there. These are all products are relational databases or these all products are implemented based on relational data model. Relational data model is a concept is there. Up here, data model is a concept is there. What is that one you must familiar before we are starting award these type of courses or these type of products you are interested to learn means minimum knowledge is required. Okay. Now observe here. What is this data model first? What is this data model means concentrate here easily understandable model. Don't write it just data model. What is data model means slowly observe it here. Anybody attending award previous class. I am telling one thing. Actually, suppose your Oracle is a product is there. This Oracle database or relational database, anything also Oracle database, having a two types of structures, I'm telling in a previous classes, two types of structures only, structures. One is logical structures, I'm telling only, okay, one is logical structure. Another one is physical structure, I'm telling in a previous class. Slowly observe it here. Logical structure, logical structure, I'm telling. Another one is a physical structure, I'm telling. Physical, physical structure, I'm telling only. Physical structure, I'm telling. What is a logical structure means? Suppose you are creating a what table or anything in your uh, okay, database, for example, or now here, yes, suppose I change, 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 anything in a table I'm creating like this. Whenever I'm creating a what table, or now here, yes, observe it here. Now here, already these tables are there, okay, totally. And now here, suppose I'm creating a what this table in my okay, database, for example, whenever I'm creating a what a table, this one, this is not visible in operating system. Observe it here. This is not visible in operating system. This is a what in my system. I'm installing a Oracle. How you are installing a Oracle also next classes we are learning only. Don't worry. Now here I'm installing a Oracle one of the stage only in a SQL and or somewhere. 
and now here in this c drive only your your table is not available whatever h h h h h is a table i am creating that is not visible not visible that's why in a c drive d drive this is not visible that's why what is logical structure means a structure which is not visible yes yes structure which is not a visible 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 in operating system visible in os in operating system is called logical structure a physical structure means whenever we are installing a what or ikl sql server db to this softwares means automatically three physical files are created i am telling you in fps classes that's why a structure which is visible in operating system is also called as here physical structure are these all the things in a previous class i am telling don't worry now observe it here what is data model first observe here these all products are implemented based on which concept relational data model in 1970 onwards this is a new model one fellow is introducing only i will tell you but before that one what is this data model means easy data model anybody have any idea any computer students are there they well known persons don't write it anything these are demos okay data model data model represents data model data model represents represents how data is represented data model defines data model defines how data is represented observe here how data is represented represented at logical structure of the database at logical structure of the database logical structure of the logical structure of the database how much easy definition observe here logical structure of the database and now check it out screen observe it here what is logical structure in a previous classes i am telling only here you a structure which is not a visible in operating system that is called logical structure or maybe you are creating a table means that is not visible in operating system but that structure is visible in a database or not very good now here in this in this database in this database how data is represented that is specified in the format of what something only records only but unfortunately these collection of records are in matrix format only that's why always observe it here observe it here observe it here whenever this is a logical structure is there how data is represented at logical structure in a matrix format rows and also columns only and now here that's why this is a data model how data is represented at a logical structure but 1970 onwards this type of so now data is represented at a logical structure in a relational data model relational data model means data is represented in the format of matrix matrix means nothing but a what rows and columns are not nowadays that is also called as two dimensional tables two dimensional tables but 1970 before this data model is not there hierarchical data model network data model some other data models are there ims software idms softwares are there in those days so now we are different softwares idms ims these type of softwares are there but nowadays observe here data model is nothing but defines how data is represented at a logical structure of the database and now check it out concentrate right here and now here suppose in a 1970 onwards this data model is there in a 19 where the oracle is there means next we are learning first just roughly observe here in 1970 ef card don't write it anything just observe it some terminology new thing you know? ef card introduced he is a mathematician he is working in a where ibm company those days introduced introduced relational relational data model relational data model okay so in 1970 ef card introduced the relational data model relational data model means data model means what what is the logical in a logical structure how data is represented okay na yes relational data model means in a logical structure this is a logical structure no this structure is not visible in operating system or not in this logical structure how data is represented in the format of rows and columns that is nothing but a two dimensional tables observe it here in relational data model in relational in relational data model data model data is represented represented data is represented represented so in two dimensional tables represented in the format of rows and columns that is nothing but a what in two dimensional tables two dimensional two dimensional two dimensional tables okay na yes here but unfortunately slowly observe here 
why these relational data model okay relational data model products we are operating also then we have so now here yes sql language we are using that is the biggest tree we are learning next only whenever we are our course is starting only this is a big concept observe here but why these relational data model products are so easy why these relational data model products are very easy suppose you are learning oracle you are learning mysql you are learning a db2 any relational data model products we are, you are learning also that easy everyone telling in a world where any software engineer you are asking also they are telling about that easy why me is reason is there always any relational data model product we are observing also relational data model mainly mainly consist of three components mainly consist of consists of three components only three components what are those components means observed here these names you must be familiar before we are starting our courses what are the components are available means these are first observed here now check it out concentrate here what is the first one means simple collection of collection of database objects database objects or maybe in these type of softwares or i call sql server db2 these softwares are yes in what it will be available means collection of database objects are available what is this one means that is daily we are learning actually observe it here slowly observe it here relational data model mainly consists of three components what is first one means collection of database objects collection of database objects means that easy suppose you are a first time newcomer also you are understandable suppose you are learning a oracle course for example oracle is a relational data model product suppose some other fellows are learning sql server okay sql server is a relational data model product again my sql is a relational data model product from different different companies okay fine but in a oracle which database objects are available nothing is there maybe first time newcomer having idea table no table is a database object here also table is there here also table is there my sql also table is there same again here view is a database object some purpose is there again here also which one is there view is there here also which one is there view is there view is a database object here synonym is a database object is there what is synonym what is view we are learning don't worry in our course synonym is available here also synonym is available here index is there here here also index is there these are called objects here index is there okay some terminology what is this one big concepts only okay fine here and uh, now here a procedure is there okay fine here also procedure is available here also procedure is available here trigger is there trigger okay this is a database object okay, so now here also trigger is there here also trigger that's why relational databases uh, relational database relational data model products contains the uh, three components but first component is what collection of objects objects means yes here table view so procedure function triggers package so many things are there but unfortunately you are a first time newcomer means what is this purpose you have an idea means enough suppose what is the purpose of view what is the purpose of synonym what is the purpose of index what is the purpose of procedure what is the purpose of trigger what is what you have an idea where we are using this one means so one relational data model product we are learning also all the relational data model product same uses same thing only but syntactically different and functions are different but conceptually same that's why here one product we are learning in our course suppose oracle you are learning means another database also very easy not required to learn those all the things one one thing is enough perfectly that's why collection of database objects are available very easy in our courses we are learning not only collection of database objects in any relational data model products we are observing also another easy concept is there what is that one means set of operators are available operators are available operator means you are also i am also thinking about in a c language java is equal to less than less than or equal to greater than greater than or equal to not equal to these type of uh, operators are there we are thinking on not, not only these operators but also here set of operator means different different operators are there in every relational data model suppose exist is a operator okay in is a operator between is a operator okay son of here yes in so many operators are there all is a operator in a is a operator sum is a operator these are all so many different different operators are there like is a operator is null is a operator okay so like this between is a operator this type of so many special operators are there these are special 
what is this exist what is this n what is the difference between exist and n where we are using what is the performance tuning those all the things we are learning in our course what is the like what is is null what is between where we are using that's why through these operators we are operating only that's why easy but not only these two easy the first two is very easy only but not only these two another one is there that is a key concept everyone knows the database objects maybe at least you are a first time newcomer also a table you have an idea set up operators also everyone understandable oh, maybe is equal to less than something is there no same like some operators are there but unfortunately third one is most powerful this is a key concept this is so many fellows are doesn't know actually relational data model where the difficulty they are facing a learners or experienced person means otherwise interview side means third point only important these two are dead easy third point is most powerful always relational data model products are works based on set of integrity rules very 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 important these rules you have an idea you are not required to attend a classes also not required your own way also you are learning that there is enough that much of powerful these rules only so many fellows are doesn't know these rules in a google anywhere you are typing about integrity rules or okay relational database rules you are typing also nobody writing others there is experience is required so many things are there okay always uh, relational data model products these type of products works based on set of rules really that set of rules based only these are working yes now check it out some popular rules are there those rules at least to demo class said i am telling don't write it only just observe it here really first observe it here relational data model products works based on set of rules are not check it out this one today we are concentrating so many scenarios i am telling only through that one oh maybe these products are works based on set of rules you are understandable now check it out concentrate here now observe it here maybe some pillows having idea some pillows doesn't have an idea for example now check it out concentrate here example side real time scenario side i am telling suppose here one company is there don't write it here one company is there simple scenario in this company having a what two departments are there example purpose observe it here one company having a what so many departments are there two departments your understandable purpose i am telling it is a department is there and also hr is a department is there for example for example our knowledge base on hr is a department is there in this it department suppose you are a son of your is joining in a company means you are also working in a where it department or not yes here okay in this it department uh, three employees are working for example okay for example three employees are working okay fine yes here again in hr department one employee is working for example this is a small scenario is there in a company it department and hr department is there for example one one company two departments are there in this it department three employees are working hr department one employee is working suppose you are a first time newcomer how you are thinking oh nothing is there relational data model products means or so now table format only their data storing only you are thinking okay fine i am agree table format only data is storing observe here a big big okay son of here yes here tables also available okay fine these are all the tables one of these days you are good and now here check it out there is environment settings one of these days you are familiar observe here and now here check it out <clears throat> now big big tables are there okay fine this is a table format only data is there okay that scenario suppose i am a first time newcomer for example that scenario i am a little bit of experience also that scenario i am representing as a table in my oracle project side now that is working or not you are telling me is really great suppose here that is table format only i am using for example in my project suppose some little bit of experience is there emp table for example i am designing like this i am a programmer okay fine in a company now observe it here yes oh maybe here so many employees are there those employees are belongs to some department name okay fine and also these are employees these are columns how columns and data in a future you are also familiar don't worry now check it out check it out here department name is there these are columns d name and e name is a columns emp is a table for example i am representing like this here it is a department is there that is a data it is a department in this department three employees are working one is what oh, slowly observe here very interesting smith is a employee for example any employee just i am giving smith is a employee or yeah, abc employee comma allen is a employee comma what is a employee for example 
I am representing uh, what three employees are working in a way at this IT department. That's why I am representing uh, what that data in the format of like this only. Oh, maybe IT is a department. In that department, Smith, comma, Ellen, comma, what is working? Again, another department is there. What is the department? HR department is there. For example, okay. HR department, one employee is working. My name, for example, Morali is a what employee is working. For example, I am a programmer in my project. Suppose Oracle project I am working. That is a relational data model product. The data is represented in the format of tables. One scenario is there. One company is there. In that company, two departments are there. In that one department, some employees. Another department, some employees. They are giving only. I am a senior most programmer. Means I am representing a what data like this in my project. Maybe anybody academic career side, maybe a little bit of knowledge is there in a database only. Now this table is working in Oracle or not working? Anybody guess it? Either Oracle, either SQL Server, either DB2. This table is working or not working? Maybe guess it? Anybody? Very good. One fellow is telling really correct. This is not working. This is not working. Why? Because what the problem is, you in a relational data model products also, Data is represented in the format of table also. Table also some rules based only they are implementing. What is that one means? In this table here, this is a cell. This